Hi everybody, it's January 27th. As you may be able to tell from the rollers in my head, today is gonna to be a brush out day. But I thought I'd show you my outfit really quick first. So, I'm wearing a wrap dress I made last year. It's short sleeve. I really like this one. I love this fabric. And then, um, as you may be able to see, it's got this dark sort of pine green for the leaves and the flowers. So I put the pine green colored jacket with it. It's a little Christmas, but I'm okay with that. I've got my octopus brooch. And can we have a moment of silence for this lipstick? This is ColourPop Maxed Out Lipstick. It is discontinued like 98% of ColourPop makeup. And um, it broke today. So this, half of this landed on the floor. So if I want to use this, I have to um, basically use a lip brush and dig it out, which is fine. But I think it's the perfect fuchsia red pink color, red fuchsia, I'm gonna call it. And uh, I really wish I could find another example of it. ColourPop has nothing on their website even remotely like this. Um, and I can't really think of another lipstick that might be close. I compared it to Urban Decay Wonderland, which is also discontinued, and Revlon Cherries in the Snow, and it's pinker than all of those. So if anybody knows of a good red fuchsia, comment down below. So after my hair looking not great the last two days, I decided to do a flex rod set. Um, got some pros and cons on flex rods. So let me tell you what I did, and then I'll tell you how I feel about flex rods. So I parted my hair in my usual place. For my short bang area, I used Velcro rollers. I did do some sponge rollers down at the very bottom. And then I did flex roll rods just going down for my part and just rolled everything under. So I'm looking off to the side because that's where my mirror is. So flex rods, I'll take one out and I'll show you what they are. Wow. So yeah, that really curled. Um, flex rods, as you can see, give a very tight curl. They are these flexible um, rollers. They have this little core inside that looks like that. As I break one, um, you just put the little cap back on if I can. So this flexible core, and then they're wrapped with foam. So things that are good about them. They do a very tight curl. They come in a lot of different sizes. So whether you have super long hair or very short hair, there is a flex rod size for you. Um, they are very easy to roll, very easy to keep them in your hair because they just fold in on themselves. Things I don't like about them, because they are foam, they take longer to dry than other kinds of rollers, including regular foam rollers, because they don't let as much air get to your hair. Um, you cannot sleep on them, at least I can't. Your threshold for discomfort might be higher than mine, but I can't sleep on them. They're way too uncomfortable. So that's kind of means that you have to put them in and let them air dry or use a um, bonnet dryer. Uh, which I don't have, I should really invest in. Maybe for Christmas this year I will ask for that um, because I do set my hair quite often. But uh, for the most part, I think they're pretty good. They can leave your hair a little bit frizzy because they're such a tight curl, but you can mitigate some of that by wrapping larger rods. So, why did I want to use them today? Because my hair has not been holding curl very well because it's so dry and there's no humidity. And I uh, was hoping a tighter curl might be good. Something tells me this will have been a mistake. <laughs> It'll get really tight, but we'll see. I know I keep getting washed out because I'm sitting in front of the sun, so sorry about that. I wrapped this with a little bit of mousse. And this is like second day hair, second day hair. Come on, Luna, there you go. 
when I was trying to get up on the window seat so she can have some of her water. She's still using her mug every day. <laughs> yesterday, yesterday I, uh, I got the, after I did the sew along filming, I pretty much just relaxed for the rest of the day. This morning I went to work. Um, so this is the first time I've gotten to do anything really for myself all day. And uh, yeah, here we are. How did I do this? Okay, there we go. Okay. That's all. Ooh. Ooh. Get rid of my velcro wires. My hair is getting so long. My bangs really are growing out. I stretch them out, my bangs come in there now, so they're really long. So that'll be good. Soon I'll be able to wrap them with my regular rollers. All right, I'm gonna break this up with my hands. Oh, there's still a roller back here. There's always one roller left, I swear. Um, I'm gonna take a little bit of my Got To Be Too Chic Blackberry and Coconut Oil Serum. You guys have seen me do this before. Not much, not much. And I'm just running this through my hair. These curls are in here. That's the great thing about flex rods, man. If you want like curls that are really there, they're good for that. And I'm using a little bit more of this stuff than normal because I do think I'm gonna go real frizzy. <laughs> All right, Denman styling brush. trying to decide if I'm going to put the dark dye back through my hair again and try to hide my gray and blend in the parts that are kind of blue or if I'm just going to leave it alone. It's been about a month, so it's time if I'm going to do it again to do it. Um, I really wish I could just use um, peroxide-based dye because I've gotten used to dark hair now, which is crazy after so many years of having like neon bright colored hair. I've really gotten used to the dark hair and I would love to be able to just put a peroxide based like semi-permanent dark brown on it and just call it good, but my hair, I still am scared to use peroxide after I had that one bad reaction. So, I just gotta get what I can out of the more temporary stuff. Oh wow, this has worked pretty well. What is this? This is interesting. There we go, that's pretty cute. Got a lot of volume and height. One of the things I like about not having bangs, I get that little 50s swoop in the front. Ah, that came out pretty good. Flex rods. Maybe worth all the trouble. They actually are, and they're not that much trouble. It's just I'm lazy and want to be able to just sleep in rollers. But I don't know. This is a pretty good set, I think. I mean, it's cute. Like I said, a little tight, but maybe that means tomorrow I will not have to actually set my hair. Wouldn't that be nice? Ooh, it'll frizz back up quick though. Yeah, I think, I think we're in leave it well enough alone territory. So let's just have a look at what's happening in the back. I can't see. That's like the worst part about doing it out here instead of in like my bathroom. 
back of my head. Oh, it looks like it's okay though. All right, there we go. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna I'm gonna go with. I think it's kind of fun. I've been um, very into like that sort of midi hair Liz Taylor Ava, Taylor Ava Gardner thing. Now that my hair is back, and I think I think mission accomplished with that. All right, so there we go. We will we'll leave it there. Hair brush out. I'll see you guys tomorrow.